hello guys welcome to how to fix track in this video guys I will be showing how to troubleshoot the issue the program can't start because VC run timer 140 DLL is missing from your computer okay so if you want to open a program and it's not opening and throwing this error this video is for you I will show you step by step how to troubleshoot this issue so guys this error is basically related to the Microsoft distributable okay so we need to reinstall it or you can repair it so first we will try to repair it go to control panel open control panel and go to large icons here if this step doesn't work I will show you how to reinstall the fresh and latest Microsoft dis distributable image look for this option you can see Microsoft distributable just click on change and once you click on change you will see the repair options here if click on yes button when the prompt opens so this package you can see here 2015 to 2020-2022 first you need to troubleshoot this issue like this okay successful close okay once this is closed just restart your system and relaunch the program if you are able to access it or not if still you are not able to access it so open the Google Chrome or any other browser to install the latest redistributable image and on the search bar you need to tap there visual C++ redistributable just hit click on that and go to first latest supported C++ click on download option here and scroll down and look for and you can see the option if you are using the old PC you can choose the older one but if you are using latest click on the first one and it will go to the link okay so this this is for 32 bit this is for 64 bit so how to check which you are using tap their system information and you will get here the 64 bit base you can see system type is 64 bit based okay if you have 32 bit you need to choose this option 86 click on this since I have 64 bit base system you can see it's downloaded go to its folder or just run it from here open it click on run ok click on agree and click on install just install it like this ok now the installation is done you must restart your system it is also showing the you must restart your system click on restart and then relaunch it after the restart if issue still persists we will repair to we will hit to commands to repair our PC right click run as administrator click on yes button when the prompt opens if your window is corrupted sometime you get this issue as well you need to type there sfc space less scan now this is the popular command to repair the windows corruption sfc stands for system file checker in my many windows you can see this we have used too many times sfc commands is very good just wait it and once this is 100% just restart your system also make sure you have updated windows on your laptop or the PC and no corruption with your windows update and security click on check for update 
and if you have view optional updates here you just need to click on that and wait and update your windows if still persists the issue you can uninstall that program which is not running and reinstall it okay so this is how you can troubleshoot this issue so hope your issue is fixed after applying these methods if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech